Hello, I'm Chris Menard. In this video, I'm going to show you what to do when your Google account, which gives you for free 15 uh, gigabytes GB, what to do when it's getting full. So Gmail came out in 2004, and I've had Gmail since 2004. If you open up your Gmail account and you scroll all the way to the bottom and look down in the bottom left corner, it's telling me 14.21 GB of 15 GB used. And then it's got the word manage. So I'm about to hit my 15 gig limit and then I won't better use Gmail. So I'm going to hit manage. Three different places could be taking up your videos. And by the way, they know I'm getting close to 15 because they want me to upgrade. So you can pay, and I'll be honest with you, 100 gigs $19 a year, that is really inexpensive, but I'm cheap and I don't want to pay in this example. So I could hit upgrade, but I'm going to hit dismiss here. You don't have to do that step. It's showing you right here in the middle of your screen, 15.2, the three places that could be using space in your Google account. So in case you're wondering, I'm a big fan of Google Photos. <clears throat> The reason I'm not using any space is I have a Google Pixel phone, so they don't count that. My Gmail is obviously at 11 gigs, and my Google Drive is at 3, so I'm going to show you those two real quick. If I click, I'm going to do the Google Drive first. It's the easiest one to do. If you click on this icon, it's going to take you into your Google Drive, and this is a cool feature from Google. They sort your Google Drive from storage used up in the top right, notice the arrow is pointing down at the most heavily used files. So it's showing you files, not folders. This was, this was within three gig the other day, so I'm trying to figure out why this is. There's my answer right there. I don't need that video, so I'm going to remove it. So there's two gigs right there, but here's some other stuff. You sit here and decide what you need to delete, right click, and just simply remove it. So now let's take a look back at the, the one that's trickier. Again, since 2004, I've had Gmail. Click here. It's going to open up my Gmail again, even though I already had it open. No big deal. When I'm looking at my Gmail, I would click up at the top where it says search. I would go to size greater than is already in here. I'm going to start with 15 MB. You can hit this drop down to make sure it says MB. You'll get less emails at 15 MB than you would at 4 MB. So 15, I'm looking for stuff greater than. So when I hit search, let's see how many emails I get. There are four emails and threads that are over 15 meg right there. Do this again. I'm, look, you can just change it right here, by the way. So that was 15, I'm gonna make it four. Instead of having four, I've got over 100 right here. And now if you wanted to, you could come in here and do these by date. So within one day, change that to within one year. This should look one year back and forward. Remember I had this since 2004, so I'm just making this date up. I'm going to put in January 1, 2007, search. In other words, I want to get rid of the big ones, but the big ones that are older, I don't want to get anything rid of anything big that's fairly recent. I still got 34 right there, so there's an example of that. And there's the date of 5-3 for me through 11-15. Anyway, I hope that helps with clearing out your Google account, Gmail, and Google Drive. I know I didn't show you photos. Just go into your photos, back them up if you need to, get rid of whatever you don't need to. Thank you. Have a great day. Feel free to subscribe to my YouTube channel.